It's all about the view. The view of the daily hustle and bustle harbor. A safe haven for boats and wild animals. They're so cute. These little harbors hug the inlets of the Pacific coast of Western Canada. Wow. That's what it's all about for Ali and Mark. They're searching for a home with a vibrant harbor view that they can call their own. We're in the view. But what will their dream view cost? Now, it's time to find out what's for sale with a view. Ali and Mark come by their mutual love of being by the water honestly. Well, I'm an island girl, and part of being an island girl is enjoying and loving that harbor view Growing up loving airplanes and loving float planes and uh, watching them take off and land is something that I really enjoyed. We love to watch people moving, boats coming in and out, planes coming in and out, people kayaking, those kinds of things. They really inspire us and just offers a really nice balance for us to be able to see other people enjoying active, healthy living. And that for us actually offers a sense of tranquility. But at the moment, they're missing that sense of calm in their busy lives. We are very active people. We play a lot of field hockey and we're very involved locally. We coach, we umpire, we play. For some reason, we just never stay still. So um, definitely looking for something that can help us break away from that. Watching the boats and watching the airplanes and just watching the marine life is just something that we, we, have, we, don't, we don't do it right now and it would really benefit our life if we were able to do that. A uh, harbor view with that sort of marina feel, uh, I think that really gives us a nice little oasis and it's really part of the island life that we're, we're really hoping to have in our normal home life. On their journey to find out just how much Ali and Mark's harbor view will cost is realtor Jason Banab. Ali and Mark live such busy lives, they're always on the go. These properties represent a chance to sit back and relax and enjoy the view. It'll be interesting to see if they can actually slow down their pace and take it all in. Jason's plan is for Mark and Allie to see a wide range of properties with views from completely different perspectives. For the first tour, Jason shows them a property that's built right on the harbor. Look at the garden. Isn't that nice? Oh, I love it. Yeah, let's take a look. Such a nice entranceway. Welcome. This stilt home is one of 14 homes built in the bay. It features an open-plan main floor, two bedrooms, and a 280-foot oceanfront deck with a price tag of $599,000. This is built by an award-winning builder, just over 1,250 square feet. This is a stilt home on the water. Will Allie and Mark fall in love with this view of the harbor? Welcome. God, it's so nice. Look at the view. We're so close. Wow. It's awesome. Yeah, I like it. Oh, you don't get any closer to the water than this home. Look at look at the swans. Look at the swans coming in right now. Can well, we go check it out? Yeah, Absolutely. Let's go check it out. Yeah, go take a look outside. Go ahead. Can't believe they're right here. There's wildlife at your feet. Yeah, no kidding. It's beautiful. Oh, that is so cool. It's awesome. I can't believe this would be like our backyard. Yeah, it's amazing. I love the boats and the the island and. And the wildlife's really and nice. the swans that just happen to pay a visit. I mean, the water, I mean, it's, it's perfectly calm out there for me, canoeing or kayaking or stand-up yeah. paddle boarding. I always wanted to get a canoe, and, oh, nice. and this would be a really good opportunity. Unfortunately, Ellie won't canoe with me. Oh. I'm more of a stand-up paddle board type of person. Okay. Let's go take a look inside. There's so much more to show you. Great. I absolutely love this kitchen. I love to cook, and Mark loves to cook, and uh, I definitely love the feel of this kitchen. It feels very country, but also modern, and mm. I think that's it has the right feel for me, so that's important. I love the, the island. It's great for hosting, because mm -hmm. you're always going to have lots of people, and every party goes to the kitchen, right? That's right, and it's open concept <laughs> right back into the uh, the living room. I think this is great. I can finally have a nice big space to bake, and oh, nice. so it's a really nice layout for us and for our lifestyle, mm -hmm. for sure. Okay, well, why don't we continue on and take a look at the rest of the home? Sounds good. good. You've got these beautiful wood ceiling, the beams. I like how high it is. It feels very open. I love the fireplace, and I like the space. It's uh, not too big, not too small, and it still has that really cozy feel mm. to it. They've definitely brought the, the modern in with kind of more of a rustic feel, so they've done a good job with it. And again, just being able to look out the windows every morning would be pretty cool. Yeah, that view is unbelievable. Why don't we take a look upstairs? They've continued the beautiful hardwood right throughout. It's still a high ceiling. Yeah, really high. And welcome to the master bedroom. Very nice. And the view. And the view. And the view. A great view.
We've never been able to wake up in the morning and have that kind of a view, um, and that's just what we're looking for. I'd probably get rid of the desk just so I could enjoy home and uh, not be working in the bedroom. I mean, if you did want to reclaim the space, you could easily extend the closet. There is double closets in here already, but if you don't want to use the desk, you could just continue this on. Double closet's a good idea. She loves big closets, lots of stuff. Tons of shoes, so many shoes. <laughs> <laughs> the bathroom's just across the hallway, so let's go take a look at that. I think you'll, you'll like it. Awesome. Definitely a lot bigger than I thought it was gonna yeah, be. Yeah, it's big. Yeah, the vaulted ceiling makes it feel a lot bigger. I mean, it is a spacious bathroom. Yeah, I like how it's separate with the bathtub and the shower. We love walk-in showers. Having a soaker tub, I think, is gonna be a great step for us, because do a lot of sports, mm -hmm. and it's great to put your legs into a, dare I say, ice bath. I was going to say, <laughs> you're, you're leading towards a cold bath, which yeah. is opposite with what, what uh, most people are thinking. Are you a bather also? Or? We have such busy lives, and to be able to come home and have a bubble bath or something, mm -hmm. we've never had that option before, so that's, yeah, that's really good. appealing. That's good. I'm glad you like it. Let's take a look at the other bedroom. Sounds good. So this is the second bedroom. Nice size. Yeah, it's a good space. Um, nice to have a second bedroom for sure. We always have our parents dropping in or other guests. They might not want to move out. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's nice. Lots of light in here. The windows are huge. So we finished upstairs. Let's go downstairs and discuss things. Sounds good. Just be careful walking along here. Nice big dock here. So here we are on the dock. Really nice appreciation looking back at the home. Super well constructed. Oh my gosh. Oh, look over there, otters. Oh my goodness, look at them. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it looks like when I try to get out of the pool. My, that is awesome. They're so cute. This stilt home is located on the water. Two bedrooms, two bathrooms, over 1,250 square feet on two levels. And the view is everywhere. The home is priced at five hundred ninety-nine thousand. Okay. So, what are your thoughts on everything? From every room, you've got a beautiful harbor view. The, the one thing I would say there's no no airplanes in this harbor, and I'm a big airplane buff. Yeah, to be able to have this kind of setting right in our backyard is pretty awesome for us. So the view is spectacular. It was not what we expected coming off the street, and you could see the view from from all the different rooms. But I really did look forward to seeing some some float planes landing in the harbor, and we don't have that here. When you're looking for a home, there's always going to be compromise. Flow plane missing here, it's not that big of a deal. They can move on. Mark and Allie are on the hunt for a house with dream views of a lively, animated harbor on the west coast of Canada. The first tour was a surprising one. Look at, look at the swan. The couple enjoyed a one-of-a-kind view from a one-of-a-kind property. We're so close. Wow. It's awesome. Jason is showing Allie and Mark harbor views ranging from sea to sky. So next up is a bird's eye view from the penthouse. This refined elevated space features a 1,350 foot south facing outdoor deck and 2,000 feet of interior space. It's listed at $1.2 million. Are these the type of inspirational views the couple are thinking of? Come on in. Wow. There's a lot of stuff. <laughs> don't, don't look at the things. We're going to look beyond that, because the real wow factor here is the view. OK. Follow me. Open concept, massive dining room, living room, gas fireplace, and the view. That's nice. Wow. 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 Yeah. Ocean views, Olympic mountains, yep. ferry boats, float yeah, planes. Well, I'm actually a bit speechless because the view is spectacular. Yeah, no, it's great. You can see the view of little uh, rock islands in the bay there, and the, the mountains are behind. It's fantastic. The harbor, the mountains, it really is spectacular. One thing to know is this, this deck space here is 1,350 square feet. We definitely like to host parties, like to have people <laughs> over. So this is, this is ideal for that. Good. Entertaining, is, for sure. Yeah, you guys <laughs> are big and entertaining. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's great. You hear it right now. There it is right there. Yeah. It's coming in. Wow. What kind of plane is that? That's a turbo water. Wow. Of course he knows that. <laughs> it's fantastic. Right in front of us. All day long. Nice. I'm actually just speechless because we've been after this harbor view and 
it's so unique because we're so high up. It just feels like it's just for us. Beautiful harbor views, canoes and kayaks coming, ferry boats coming. They're float planes all the time. Thanks. Nice. That's the good news. Yeah, it's great. This is what I'm looking for. Good. Why don't we go back inside and take a look? We've got this beautiful flowing, living, dining, kitchen, breakfast area over there. Very spacious. It's definitely hard for me to envision us living here because there is a lot of stuff. I think if we were to choose this place, we'd probably look to give it a refreshed look, maybe paint or something. This might be a little bit dated for you, but the way I look at it is that it's a chance for you to add your personal touch, right? After seeing the view, I've got a different look on what I'm looking for inside. I'm trying to block everything out. Can you envision yourself in this space? With our first home, I think we'd love to put our own spin on things and be able to be creative. Yeah. And uh, there's definitely a lot of room for that here. Let's go take a look at the kitchen. We've got a large granite island here, great for entertaining. Breakfast table there, beautiful windows, lots of light. I really like the space here for breakfast. I can just see us having coffee in the morning there. Yeah, it's kind of nice with the bay window is looking outside. Um, and even a small little offside patio for, for breakfast would be good in the summer as well. For me, you know, given the size of this unit, I'm quite surprised how tight it is in here. We do tend to host sometimes, and we like to do a lot of work in the kitchen when we're doing so, so this is a bit of a small work area. Yeah. Renovating the space, you can always move this. I mean, there's, there's definitely options. It's, it's more about the space. These are all cosmetic things, right? Let's take a look at the master bedroom. I think you'll really like it in there. They've got a lighter color in here, so it feels brighter and airier. And the view. And the view. I really like the view. I think we that's what we're after when we wake up in the morning. Um, I am a little concerned with the tightness of the space in here. And I'm a little, I don't really like the shutter windows, but I'm sure we could change those. Let's go talk about the home outside. Enjoy the view for the last moment. This is a nice covered area. I think this is you know, nice for waking up in the morning. We have a barbecue out here. Absolutely. I'm still blown away by this view. No, it's, it's definitely for like a top. big round table in this area. And my sun chairs. And sun chairs in this area <laughs> for sure. So we do have southern light exposure east and west, so great all day sun here. View is definitely the most important thing for us. Like this is this is what we're looking for. And the fact that float planes are coming in right here. <laughs> that's all we need. Every 20 minutes. This beautiful view, this backdrop, this 1,350 square feet of deck and almost 2,000 square feet inside. It's priced at just over $1 million. I can totally understand it. I think the view is great. I think we're in a great location, lots of things going on. And this is a one of a kind view. And this unit is very, very unique. Definitely suits our sort of lifestyle. Yeah, I can see us living here. Ali and Mark both really were taken back by the view. I mean, it goes without saying, this is an unparalleled, spectacular view here. The feeling of this unit really still gives me that sense of calm and oasis, and we do have busy lives, so I really feel like this is a place we can come home to and enjoy and relax. Watching float planes flying by and marine life frolicking in the harbor is the view Allie and Mark are wishing for. It's fantastic. Realtor Jason has shown them properties with views on the harbor and looking over the harbor. Wow. Yeah. For the third property, the views are right in the harbor that you can access by water taxi. It's a waterfront community called Fisherman's Wharf. Thank you very much. So many different colors. Oh yeah, it's all about eclectic here. It's all about me standing out here. I mean, look at this thing. Purple, pink, yeah. blue. There's like restaurants all yeah. down beside Sushi the houses. place, we got Mexican food. We obviously have fish. Look yeah. at the seals. Let's see, right here. Okay. He's so calm. So you guys wanted a home with a harbor view. Yep. Here we're looking at a home on the harbor, a float home. I'm definitely excited. I can't believe we're right in the middle of the harbor. Yeah, we're right on the water. This is going to be good. This cute and unique float home is 430 square feet with two bedrooms and one bathroom. It's not just fabulous views that this home offers. 
but a chance to live in the harbor itself. The list price is $249,000. Is this the little oasis that Ali and Mark are after? So this is all about lifestyle here. And these wow. people all hang out together and they look out for each other. They're like so mine. adorable. Yeah. I love the, the boardwalk and the fact that the, the houses are left on top of you, like it's mm. a movie set almost. Yeah. There's a lot of character here, a lot of different styles, as you can see. And there's the view. <laughs> Holy. Float planes, ferries. And the float planes come right, right, right down along there. there. Yeah, that's yeah, all. Awesome. Just land right here, taxi the way right into the inner harbor. Nice. Coming and going all day, roughly every 20 minutes. It's fantastic. Yeah. It's beautiful. Let's go take a look at the home. I mean, from, take a look from here. Isn't that cool? Wow. Uh, let's take a look inside. I'll grab the door for you. Oh, wow. Isn't this cool? This is really neat. Wow. I want you to experience this and take it in. And what are your thoughts? It's for sure different. Yeah, it's got a, definitely got the view out that, that backside there. And I've lived here my whole life, and I have never been in a float home before. So it's definitely interesting. Yeah, it's amazing how many people didn't even know this existed. But talk about a view. That's why we're here. It's about that. Yeah, there's definitely a, a harbor view right through there. Smaller space, a lot of wood. Um, it looks like we got room to park a boat outside. Oh yeah, I mean they've got canoes and kayaks on the side of the home. So for active people that want really want that sports lifestyle, canoeing, kayaking at your feet, go for a quick run, amazing cycling around here. There's a lot of opportunities. Like I said, this is a lifestyle we're looking at here with a view. And how big is this place? This is about 430 square feet, one full bathroom, yeah. and two bedrooms. Two bedrooms. Two bedrooms. And 430 square feet. <laughs> yeah. And sorry, they're right through here? They're right through there, yeah. Take a look. Wow. And yours? It's not, really small. There's not yeah. a lot of room for my no, clothing. It's the same on this side. If you wanted, you could actually make this all into one big bedroom okay. instead of two smaller ones. OK. Probably a good option. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's take a look at the space over here. Yeah, there's. we do have some things we need to offload to move in here, but there's room for a bed and there's room for an office space. This is thinking truly outside of the box. Yeah. It might not be for you, but it might if you well, give it some thought. I can definitely take appreciate it. it. I, I've never been down here before, so um, it's definitely a unique experience. You are active people, and I really wanted to show you this. You've got the canoeing and kayaking at your feet. It's a lifestyle on the harbor. So we've got the view, and we've got the potential for a fantastic lifestyle. I can tell by your facial expressions you are intrigued, and this home is priced at 249000 Okay. Okay. So two bedroom, one bathroom, 430 square feet. It's got a very homey feel. Definitely, it is small. But I can really appreciate the fact that we're right there mm -hmm. to all the activity that we would possibly want. And I do feel quite a bit of comfort in here. The view is right there. We, we are in the view right now, and I can feel that. So, well, that's, so good. that's good. The whole environment is really unique, something that uh, we've never really encountered before. And being able to use the water taxi and having the seals there and the, the float planes coming right down across, is it's a totally different neighborhood than we're used to. Ali and Mark got into the view. Mm, I'm just not so sure if they got into the house. Mark and Ali are searching for a dream home that gives them a sense of peace and serenity with outstanding views of an active harbor. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> There's the view. The couple has seen a range of properties from high to low, each with a different view of the harbor. <laughs> now it's time for them to decide which one could suit them best. Oh, that is so cool. We've seen a fantastic harbor view assortment from three different properties. Let's recap. The first property, the stilt home. Two bedrooms, two bathrooms, 1,250 square feet with that beautiful kitchen for baking and entertaining, those vaulted ceilings, reclaimed hardwood floors, spectacular deck, harbor setting, and otters. <laughs> Priced at $5.99. Yeah, I, I had a really good feeling about the one, the stilt home. It was a good size for us, great for entertaining. It was mm. right on the harbor. There weren't any seaplanes coming in for a landing, but it offers that beautiful harbor view from every room in the house. The second property, the penthouse. Spectacular setting, ocean views, float planes coming every 20 minutes. 
1,350 square foot deck, south facing, pure sunbathing heaven out there and entertaining, uh, with close to 2,000 square feet inside of open concept, priced at just over $1 million. I think I really could see us living in the penthouse. We really loved that one. I mean, it had the exact view we were hoping for, the mountains, the water. It just made us feel so calm, and we just really enjoy that coastal life. Great deck outside with great views with the flow planes coming in. It's, uh, it's definitely a million dollar view. I think that had, for sure had the best view of the three of them. I, I, couldn't, I couldn't even believe how incredible it was to be on top of the world there. And the third property, the float home. Amazing lifestyle on the harbor. Two bedrooms, one bathroom. 430 square feet, priced at 249000 I absolutely love all the different colors of all the different homes, but, you know, still a little bit too small for what we were looking for. Again, right in the harbor, though, very unique, very quaint little community for sure. Three properties. What are your thoughts? Well, I think after seeing the variety of three properties, it's pretty safe to say that we've definitely eliminated the float home. Okay, I'm not surprised by that choice. Uh, it was right on the harbor, it had the great view. Yeah, it was just a bit small. So that leaves two properties, the stilt home and the penthouse. Given our wish list of having an incredible harbor view and you know our active lifestyle, I think we've definitely been able to narrow it down to one of those two properties. Okay, do you care to share? <laughs> <laughs> You're killing me here. It's the, uh, the stilt home. Nice. Well, the stilt home offered us the views from every room in the house. The fact that we can still live our active life from, right from our front door is so, so important. From the moment we went out onto that deck and down to the dock, it totally had me. The view, the smell, just the calm sense of home feel. I really knew when we saw those three swans come up to us that that was definitely going to be the one that we would choose.